Stupid. She just fell unconscious. The commoners claim it's our princess. Oh, right. okay, I'll to check it out then. Geralt! It's good to see you. The commoners claim Stannis is involved in Saskia's poisoning. They're looking to slaughter him. What's stopping them? The knights. Adernian noble lords. Not easy to raise a hand against a blue blood. A peasant by the name of Calton was at the council. He didn't seem to respect anything or anyone. Calton's a blackguard. He'll use any excuse to raid and plunder. He has a taste for noble blood. They say he buries gold looted from the lords in some gorge. I know my friend was telling me about the mob Looks like things are getting nasty. Have, like, unlimited inventory, which would be great because I'm constantly out of Hear me! right now. What do you want? I'm Skill and Bolden. I keep order and Vulgan. Are doing a nice job then? Where was you when they poisoned Saskia? Give us the prince! Get the flails! Stop! Yorveth! Squirrels! Everyone who wants to leave this yard in one piece, keep your hands off your weapons! I don't care if you're a serf or a lord. I'll kill you all if need be. What's going on? The servant carrying wine during the feast said that Prince Sternes and Olgan poisoned Saskia. We want justice! You want revenge. It's not the same thing. We don't care. Saskia's fallen as if dead, while the poisoning prince and noble lords rush to herd us onto the field and sell us to Henselt. We won't let them! You lie, Carlton. Nobody's being sold out. The poisoner must be caught and tried by law. Your law? What then? He'll pay a fine and get spanked on his ass. We'll spank him, all right, with an axe to the throat. Where's this servant? Safe. The square tail keep an eye on him. Why is the prince hiding in his house if he's innocent? Enough! I'll shoot the first to reach for a weapon. Then heads will start falling. There's more of us. You can't kill every... Then you'll be first. Now back off! Your is such a badass. We need to act quickly. What's your plan? I'll frighten them a little. Bleed them if need be. I'll buy you some time, but be swift. I can't hold them off for long. Question the peasants and the nobles, and talk to the dwarves. Maybe you can get to meet Stennis. Even if he's guilty, I'm sure he's prepared a suitable story. You'll know how to sort the sheep from the goats. Also, find the servant who started talking so suddenly. You won't have time to talk to everyone, though, that's for sure. Humans only care how their asses rise as their stations do. They're playing into it. Let me save real quick. Start at each other's throats. That's the same. Come over here. 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 Those would just be craving gold. He'd better search. Yeah, once done with the prince, he'd better take him. You know Saskia's servant? Willie of the Oblates. He, he uh, handled the wine, actually, indeed, but loves the virgin like a sister like a and mother beast. put together. He'd gladly get he's caught out for her. He's not a wolf monster. He's just called Where's the white this wolf of because of his white hair. You can't his shack, really see afraid his, of them lords. His Squirrels guard him. But, um, usually witchers have white hair because of the um, training that they go through. The prince stood right next to Saskia during the council. Did he have access to the wine cellar beforehand? He gets those eyes because oh, should the I know? Do to them. Why flap so your mouth then? The prince is a wealthy lord. Bribing a skivvy to poison the wine is nothing to him. Just because someone can afford gold teeth doesn't mean they'll pull their healthy ones. Not really. What's he it really just, all about? Can, Who's backing um, you? We want justice. We don't like need a, no one backing us. We knows what to do. How would you punish the prince? Hunts, if a lad counts uh, hens wrong, he'll be flogged. Them. What should we then do with a man poisoning others? Kill him. A land without a ruler is a nightmare. We have a ruler, the Virgin of Eden. It's not certain she'll live. Then we'll choose another who will manage. But he must be one of us lads. That way he'll understand us. And all people is gonna be equal. Our way. And the non-humans? We have enough dung on the field. Away with... Farewell.
Give us his whole power! What would the prince gain with the virgin's death? You I could tell you what he lost with a life. Change your tone when we put I'd gladly hear you. Finally! It's obvious Henselt bribed some serf who then did what he was told. The local peasants love Saskia. Those surly dogs would gleefully accept... That's interesting. Just think it through. The prince couldn't have done it. The wine was in plain sight. Only the servants touched the decanters. And who are they? Then that same commoner in... Something to think of. Save yeah, your facts for your hog smelling I'd woman. gladly hear you. Finally! It... Oh, same guy. Hence... Doesn't he have sorcerers that... There's no... That's in... Alright, Skyrim. Thanks for then stopping that's by. Have a wonderful life. night. I'd gladly... Finally! It's the same guy. That's in... Just think it... Say, Witcher, come over here. Can we have a word? Why not? I'm Ogden, a founder. I cast mugs, plates, Definitely chalices. You need any, Witcher? No, thank you. It is. My goblets are in dis... Saskia's... Aye, it was. Back in... Who ordered the go... That goblet was a gift. The last liked it... Was the order... F not a chance. It was... The other chalices... Of course... Any chance there could have been two identical goblets? Why, there's no craftsman that comes close to me in Vergen. Could someone have tried to copy your handiwork? Ha! I know of one who's been trying for... See you at the inn. The prince Enough oh, of this charade! Uh, Try to be reasonable, uh, folks! Sit down and talk in peace! Uh, We've talked yeah, enough! Come on, lads, let's drag the things. prince from his oval! Vergen's not a cesspit for anyone to shit in. There are laws to abide, and Scalen Burden's job is to uphold them. There's no law allowing a serf to threaten a king's scion. I still grat- Does it matter who was born in a castle and who in a pigsty? Any fool can prejudge and condemn. It's easier to accuse than to prove guilt. A peasant servant claims that Prince Stennis suppose of- Why would the prince do such a dastardly deed? That's why! The mongrel covets the crown! Do you even remember how valorous he was towards pretending to be with her? He was slight, but us lads ain't so. See for yourselves how the commoners hate the prince, spitting venom like adders. Saskia's servant. Where is this servant, might I ask? If he's got something to say, why does he. The answer is simple. He's a fraud. He's hiding to save his skin from you, horse hands. One last question How could the prince poison Saskia? It's a known fact that servants taste wine from the barrel. No need to poison the wine. Smearing the poison inside the chalice would be enough. I never heard of anyone poisoning a chalice. You haven't heard much then. One of the Emperor's forebears died after sampling some lamb. He was always scared of poison and ate supper with his cook. The murderer spread poison on one side of a knife. Then he cut the meat so that only a small piece was poisoned. The witch is right! Give us Stennis! Saskia's got her own chalice. It was commissioned from one of the dwarves. The order came with a very detailed drawing. Even so, how did it come into Saskia's hand? A good point. We can't be sure if the prince poisoned the wine. Stannis is blowing hot and cold. Everyone knows that. You were supposed to prove his guilt, not insult him, yokel. Tell us who else would do it. A peasant wanted to hurt the miss? Never. It's cause of her, you noble... A pig won't cut its own throat! Perhaps it is no peasant's deed. However, that... Answer me this. Was not Stannis's room next to Saskia's? Do not the wines come from his own lights red and... Yes! It... Nobody in Vergen wants to kill Saskia. And even if they wanted, nobody but Stannis could do it. Those are just words. Too much guesswork and not enough evidence. You can't convict anyone based on that. Your Highness, this is dangerous. I am not afraid. Fear is a commoner's trait, unfit for one with royal blood running in his veins. What do you want, to judge me? Is a prince a common thief who steals a dozen eggs at the market? You stand before royal majesty, and you raise your hands against it. In this world there are crimes that can be forgiven and crimes that, by any means, cannot. Just as a mother killing her own child, or a man slitting his own brother's throat cannot be forgiven. 
A crime against one anointed by the gods themselves also cannot be condoned. He who raises hand against divine right is not worthy to walk this world. And what about he who poisons the Virgin of Eden? Firstly, Saskia is alive, so no one can blame me for her death. Secondly, you have no proof that it was I who tried to murder her. And thirdly, I assure all gathered here, I won't rise above the law. However, only she, the Virgin of Eden, can judge me. Can it? And if Saskia won't get well, who's gonna judge you? I believe she can be cured. But if the gods decide otherwise, we'll summon a coven of the wise who can pass just sentence. Those are words worthy of a true sovereign. I am the one you should look to for guidance. Let my deeds be the flame that lights up your darkness. The prince has a right to a fair trial, no matter if he's guilty or not. We can't deny him that. What will the peasants do if we hand them the prince? Will they hear him out? No. They'll hang him from the nearest tree or tear him limb from limb. What will happen if we allow a lynching? What if people see that might makes right? Who'll guarantee they won't desire to avenge their wrongs, real and imagined? Who'll protect people whose only fault is noble birth from the exasperated mob? And where will it lead? The peasants are furious. They didn't dare mount a frontal attack. But they haven't forgotten about Stennis, and won't. It'll be that way until Saskia regains consciousness. She won't keep order by strength alone. Unless it's a great strength. We need an authority figure. And royal blood. Five courts go to waste in the Dwarven dungeon at the moment. There's also Henselt. Going into that haunted mist is madness. Stealing Stennis away would be easier. No. Anything involving Stennis will cause a riot. I've had enough of the peasants and nobles barking. Saskia's the best leader I know. But she can't hope to defeat Henselt's army with this rabble. Which is why I'm going to get reinforcements. Where? Four Squirtel units await in hiding to the east. Time to summon them. You'll make it in time? I must. I tried locating Triss, but the mist disrupts the megascope. There's a weak signal nearby, probably on the other side. In the Kedweni camp? You'll have to pass through the mist. There's no time to lose. I'm continuously scanning the battlefield. I'll show you the way through. I'll find you when you enter the mist. Farewell, then. We still need royal blood. I know. Henselt. We need his blood, not his death. How many times do I have to tell you I'm not a Kingslayer? You wanted to discuss something? Remember the antidote for Saskia. It's very important. 